Hey, Val here. This is a schematic for a multipress factory module. The multipress being the big brother of the graphite press. This schematic is modular, which means that you can place it like this, and it will not only not completely fuck up the entire machine, but create a bigger one. I think this series could be a good way to know an even more technical side of my industry. If you think so too, please leave a like and comment. I'd really appreciate it. So the requirements for the multipress is coal and water, which is surprisingly simple. At least for me. Anyways, the coal comes in through an overflow gate and some junctions. The water comes in from a router and bridge conduit, and the graphite comes out thanks to these junctions. Junctions allow for resources coming through one side to go out the other. Here it allows the resource outline and the resource inline to share tiles, which is just incredible in my opinion. An overflow gate means that it will switch tiles if there are more resources coming in than it can handle, specifically to either one of its sides or both. The underflow gate does the opposite, sending the incoming resources to one of its sides if it can have resources go forward, and will only send straight if all sides are blocked. That's the cool and output part of it. Let's bring back in the water and see how that works. It's actually pretty straightforward. This bridge kind of would act the same as a normal bridge in that it sends the flow of whatever comes into it to its end without interacting with anything in the path. It can go up to five tiles away, well, technically gap of three, four away, five length total. Distances are weird. It's incredibly helpful for things like this, mostly because it keeps you from having to go around, which ruins both the modularity and sexiness of the overall schematic. You fugly chunk of engineering. So that's how that schematic works. You can find it here. Hope you enjoyed.